Mardi Gras is much more than just a good time for many along the eastern shore as parades and crowds made more business for local restaurants and shops. Our Baldwin County reporter Ashton Irons talked to the Eastern Shore Chamber of Commerce as they work to get creative while helping out their members. It's been a rough year for all of us, especially small businesses. That's why the Eastern Shore Chamber of Commerce is doing their best to spread a little bit of Mardi Gras cheer. The parades may be canceled this year and the streets empty, but that's not stopping local businesses from making their own good time. Many shops and restaurants have taken a massive hit to their bottom line with COVID shutdowns, cancellations and a long hurricane season. Creativity and a little competition is helping them get things rolling all over again. These streets would have been filled with people, people going to parades and then filing into restaurants and stores and, and patronizing those businesses. And so we really want to continue to support our local businesses during Mardi Gras, even if you've got to go get takeout and celebrate at home. The deadline for the jazzing it up decorations contest has already passed. Now it's time to pick a winner. First place will receive $1,000 worth of sponsorship or advertising credit with the Eastern Shore Chamber of Commerce. They need your help in picking a winner for the decorating contest. All you have to do is head to our website, fox10tv.com, for a link to vote. Reporting in Fairhope, Ashland Irons, Fox 10 News. And if you do want to get involved, voting is open until midnight on Fat Tuesday.